If you do not have an XY100, you'll have to create one to access the Moodle site. Don't worry, it only takes a couple minutes. When you access the sign-in page, just create Internet Accounts on Need an Account. There you'll be taken to another page. Here you'll have to select Guest Accounts. There's a couple other options. You can read them, but usually if you don't have a student ID, you'll have to create a guest account. Click Create. Then you'll be taken to another screen where all you have to do is add your email address, repeat your email address, add it twice, and then create a password. The password is sometimes a little bit complex. You have to have more than eight characters. I'm just going to copy paste one that I already wrote, and then I'll be taken to another screen. In this screen, I'll just um, be given a link to access my Moodle page. My Moodle page right now will have a random guest name, username. Change your username to do that. Click on the image on the left side of the screen. Click on the guest image and it'll take you to your profile. Click edit profile, add your first name, add your last name, and if you want, add an image as well. You can drag and drop from the desktop. I'm going to drag the first image that I found and drop it as my user picture. Click update profile and now I have created a profile within my Moodle account, but I have no courses yet. So to add your courses, you'll have to copy the tiny URL that we created for the course that we'll send with the Eventbrite. And then when you click on to access that, that site, you'll be taken to another screen when you'll have to type in an enrollment key. We'll also provide you with the enrollment key. These keys are not usually available for Moodle sites at the University of Minnesota, but they are available for this course so that anybody with the enrollment key can access the site. Once you have the enrollment key, self-enroll as a student, and then you'll be able to do anything that a student does within this Moodle site and access all the different activities. Thanks.